All right, Articuno, let's get this. Here we go. Okay, 20 people got it now we got to catch it so I'm told that the catch rate is either a hundred percent or pretty close today at least for the people who were at GoFest and first ball and there it is Plus the Pineab. Pokedex entry, first legendary, Articuno. Sick, sick. Frost Breath Ice Beam. Oh yeah, let's do more, let's do more. at GoFest, these legendaries have been 100% GoFest, awesome but apparently that is applied to everybody. Green circle. Green circle. First one. Yeah. First ball. First one. Nice job, nice job. just if you're in Chicago. And you got it. Got it. Woo! There we go. Might be Chicago only. Let me know in the comments if you got uh, auto catch on your legendaries um, right after GoFest. Holy crap, guys. So I took a break from editing this legendary video and we come down here to the Articuno raid. This is freaking Dragonite just chilling right in front of the raid. It was ridiculous, absolutely ridiculous. So we're gonna try to catch that and uh, let's see. Golden raspberry? Yeah, sure, golden raspberry. Elijah's gonna catch it. We haven't seen a Dragonite in a while. No, I think the last one was during the Easter event. Yeah. Six Dragonites in five days. It Go check away. out that video. First ball run away. Come on. Ridiculous. Okay. Um, but uh, I wanted to mention a couple things about Articuno. You do not need as many people for Articuno as you do Lugia. Um, I think the lowest number we've done with Articuno is eight. And I think that's fine. Like a little bit more than what you need for the level fours. Um, I'm guessing that Articuno is going to be the easiest legendary. Um, that's what it seems like at least. Uh, but I hope you enjoyed the video. Um, Articuno, a Pokedex entry, raids in, in Chicago, all that crazy stuff. Um, so this is... This is Mike, MTG Jedi. Like and subscribe, and I'll catch you in the next one.